Bill, Ohio State, the big showdown with Michigan this week, uh, the rivalry game and everything. Ohio State, um, if it, is it better off for them to win and then to get to the Big Ten Championship and win that or Well, win alumni and, are and probably going to want it. the Big Ten Championship. Right. Uh, that would only happen if they got in on a tiebreaker and Penn State lost at home to Michigan State. Now, if Michigan State plays like they did against Ohio State, right. that's, possible. that's possible. They probably won't, and it's a tough to win in Happy Valley. Right. I would think, obviously, if they beat Michigan, they're going to be in uh, as a wild card team or an at-large team, as they call it. At-large sounds mm -hmm. like something that big money and Ted Washington <laughs> should have been on. But, but, you know, I would go for the wild card route. Uh -huh. Yeah. What about... Um, more rest, more preparation. More, yeah, right. It, it does give them time, yeah. Uh, JT Barrett, um, another kind of uneven performance last week. And yes. yet Urban well, Meyer remains... Staunch in his well, yeah, uh, and the wind was really bad. Yeah. And Kosar, who played in a wind tunnel over on the lakefront, always said wind was worse than rain to throw in, uh -huh. and probably and worse than anything but bad snow. And uh, that affected everything. But J.T. Barrett has not been especially accurate this year. Um, he doesn't have the receivers he used to have. Noah Brown had like four touchdowns against Oklahoma and has done next to nothing since then. Right. Uh, they're scheming Curtis Samuel, according to Urban, on running on running games at hybrid back. And, uh, you know, he just doesn't have the weapons really. I think it's – Urban says he looks at wins and he looks at percentage completions and TDs to interceptions and that J.T. Barrett is one of the greatest quarterbacks ever to play the game in college. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to disagree with Urban Meyer's evaluation process because he's a great coach. I think he's building up his player with a little to make sure he doesn't have a crisis of confidence. Right. Makes sense. Now, I'm just going to guess on this. This is pretty much a hunch. I'm going 13-10 Ohio State, a real defensive game.